Hi everyone, this is Jennifer of Little Shelf. So this week I thought I would combine in my mailbox along with um, showing you guys some of the signatures and little things that I got from the dark days of Supernatural. Well, I got to meet Christina from the blog My World of Books. She drove down from Washington to come see the authors here. I won a contest of hers a couple weeks ago and she brought my book to me that I won for contest, Blood Wine by Yasmin Gailnorn, if I'm saying her name right. Um, and this is the ninth in the series. And because Christina is so awesome, she also gave me the first one in the series, The Witchling. And then she also threw in Garden Spells by Sarah Addison Allen. This is a book that I've been wanting to read for a while, so I'm really excited that she threw in that one. So. so thanks for those, Christina. She also gave me a really cool, like, bookmark. Oh, it's so out of focus. But it's cool. It has like a little clear bead with red in it on the end. It's a black. Both ends have the little beads. She also gave me a bookmark from Lisa Schroeder. And it's signed for the day before. And then she gave me this little pack of awesome. And it came with a little button that says join the hunt. I think. No, it's not going to focus. And some really awesome like postcards. Aren't these neat? And a bookmark. So awesome. All that for winning one book. Christina Rock. She's the one who also tells me about all of the signings and stuff that are happening. So I was lucky enough to go to two signings this week. So the first signing was The Dark Days of Supernatural, and it had um, April Lynn Pike, Veronica Roth, Amy Plum, Tara Hudson, and Ellen Shriver, and that was awesome. And then the next day, um, Allison Noel was in town, and I got to go to her signing too. So super awesome, super, super awesome week. So Dark Days books. I already um, owned Die For Me by Amy Plum. I got her signature on my book. It says, To Jennifer, Walk with Revenant, Amy Plum. Next up was Tara Hudson, and I got a really cool little, I don't know if you can see it, it says Haunted Love Bracelet. Totally matches her book, Hereafter. This book I did get this week because it just came out. Isn't it super, super pretty? It's gorgeous. And then at the hardback, like that. So see, the bracelet totally matches it. And here's her signature. It says, To Jennifer, Happy Haunting. It's Tara Hudson. And I love that this matches the color of the heart. The next author to sign was April and Pike. And I had wings on my Kindle, so I didn't get that one signed. But I did have Spells and Illusions sign. Here's her signature on Spells. It says, To Jennifer, Strive, April and Pike. And then she signed Illusions. Where is it? To Jennifer Achieve, April and Pike. And April and also gave out tattoos. This one says Team David. It's all backwards and so I don't think you can see it. And Team Tammany, I think is how you say it. I can't even see it. But anyways, tattoos. The next author to sign was Veronica Roth, author of Divergent. Here's her signature. To Jennifer, be brave. Be Roth. And she also gave out these really awesome tattoos for each of the factions in Divergent. Aren't these really cool? I should have asked her if I could have more, but I forgot. I'm sorry. I get nervous talking to authors. You don't want to look like a big dork. <laughs> and then the last one at the table is Ellen Schreiber. And there's Ellen Schreiber's signature with a little cute little happy face on there. And Ellen was also giving out um, little Three Musketeer bars, and she had bookmarks for Cryptic Cravings. It's one of the Vampire Kisses novels, which I haven't read yet. And then I had some bookmarks. So I have one signed by April and Pike, and Veronica Roth there, and Amy Plum on this one, and Tara Hudson on this one. Yeah, so that was all the awesome stuff that I got at the Dark Days of Supernatural tour. It was super fun. The girls were awesome. And if you have a chance, you should go see them. The next night, Allison Noel was in town. And I already bought a bunch of her books, but I did buy three this week. First, I bought Blue Moon. It's the second in this series. 
the Immortal series. Um, I finished the first one this week and I really, really loved it, so I had to get the second one. And if you want to see her signature, there it is. I also decided, since it's a celebration of her release, to go to pick up a copy of Everlasting just so I could get it signed. I don't have the last two books, but I wanted to get this one signed also. Isn't this book so pretty? So I have one and one, two, and three, but I don't have four and five. But I had to get six because it's the last of the series and it's pretty and I probably won't get another chance for her to sign it, at least for a while, so everlasting. And even though I already spent way too much money for the week, I bought another copy of Shadowland in a paperback just so I could do a giveaway for you guys. So I'll be putting that up sometime this week. Let's see. Signed Allison Well. And she also had a bunch of swag she was giving out. Super awesome stuff. So first she gave out little bookmarks with Everlasting on it. And the other side has the other books on it. And then she also gave out little tattoos that say Shimmer on them. This one is um, books about Ever's little sister. So. And a cool tattoo that says Everlasting with the little lotus flower on it. And then a um, bookmark. This one's um, the first book before Shimmer. This one's Radiance. So I'll be putting up a contest for this book so one of you can win it um, as soon as I get all of um, as soon as I start looking through all of the pictures from Alice Noel's thing and I even have a little video of her reading from a little part of the first chapter of Everlasting to put up to. Alright so that was in my mailbox plus some of the um, Dark Days of Supernatural and Alice Noel tour. Um, what did you guys get in your mailbox? I'm so excited for one of you to win this book.